Good morning from uh, Sunny Devon. We're on uh, Brixham uh, Breakwater. So about to get ready and do some spinning for mackerel. Hopefully get a few before I'll go back home and uh, fill the fridge for the winter uh, for bait. Uh, possibly use some uh, if you, if we catch them. Uh, possibly use some uh, for mackerel uh, barbecue. So let's get set, setting up and uh, hopefully catch some mackerel. Only joy with mackerel, first fish after about 10 15 cast. <laughs> yeah, only a little joy with. Good for talk bait. Straight down. Morning. No. No. I know. Hi for the tomorrow morning. Yeah. Just got a little uh, Joey mackerel now, first one. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I need to get him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> need to get the kayaker there. <laughs> He's looking around, wondering where it's coming from. That was close. Three, three ounce bomb let on his head. Would have been interesting. Fish on, guys. Fish on. One or two. Oh, two maybe. Or three. Sorted. Fish on, guys. <laughs> reeling, reeling. Reeling, look, look, it's coming in now. One or two. Lift it rod up. You got three on. Reeling, reeling, keep reeling. Yes, keep reeling. Well done, well done, well done. Keep going. Oh, enough, 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 enough. I got two. You got two, well done. Woo! Oh, 
Yeah, well done. Kaya's first ever mackerel. Beautiful. Do you want us to release it? Yeah. Come on, yeah. yeah, come come a little bit closer. Just drop and just it. throw it, throw it far. Throw it far. Oh my god. Yep, straight down. Straight down. Do you want to pick it up, Kenneth? Behind you, Kenneth. Pick pick it up. Pick it up. Don't worry, it won't do anything. Just pick it up. Hold it tight. Well done. Yeah, hold it here. Yeah. Tight. Hold it tight. Hold it tight. Show it to camera. Well done. Well done. Do you want to release it? Yeah. Chuck it faster though. Chuck. Round two. Go. Go. Like a flying dog. Yeah. That was like a flying dog. Oh, yeah. It's swimming. Fish on again, guys. Fish on. <laughs> Reel it fast. Find it, find it. L lift the rod tip up a bit. Like this, yeah. Reel it now. Reel fast. Well what? done. I keep going. Oh, oh, they come off. Yeah. No, keep going, keep going. That's Ian's. Is that Ian? Yours? No, Ian's that. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going fast, okay. Oh. Keep going fast, fast. Your fish coming up now. Yep. Oh, nice size. Keep going. Very good size. Well done. Enough, 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 enough. A medium fish caught this. Yeah. Well done. That's a better size. I want a medium size. Yeah. That's a good size. Better size. Try stroke it. You want to stroke it? Yeah. There you go. Fishing. One mackerel fish, but better size. Well done, Kaya. You caught this one. Hold it. Show it to the camera. Show it to the camera. That's a better size, isn't it? Do you want to, do you want to keep, keep this one for the barbecue? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, then. Let's keep this one then. Again, day two, bring some up, uh, bring some uh, break water near and in here. Uh, hopefully, get some uh, mackerel. Just set up now, 10 foot rod and a uh, 4,000 size. It's very real, 20 pounds braid on it, and uh, mackerel feathers, and a three ounce bomblet. Right, here we go. Just like the street lights lit this time Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how Five thirty in the morning. I'm at uh, Berryhead, Devon. Just heading to a rock mark. Um, gonna do a bit of spinning for bass, pollock. Well, anything on the lures. Stunning, stunning in the morning. Lovely, lovely uh, sunrise there. This place is absolutely breathtaking. This really nice so 
just heading down to the rocks over there. Hopefully get some fish. On the left hand side here, <laughs> literally there's a, like a flat platform. It's a full of people already, half five. And there are tons of people there, spinning for mackerel. Right. Um, what time was high? I think high, high about half eleven today. Just before midday. The half five now. I think uh, I'll have a couple of hours uh, on the flood here. Uh, about low tide now. Oh, a couple of hours before I want to wake up. Uh, let's see how we get on. Typical is it the seal out there waiting <laughs> and there's someone just mackerel fishing on top <laughs> you nearly caught him before I'm just throwing uh, lures about might switch over to mackerel if I can't get anything looks like mackerels are in here just got a uh, salvage I'll just get on the alarm at the moment. Seeing a bus about. Might try a Dexter Wedge in a minute. See how I get on with that. <coughs> just gonna give this a go. Never, never tried this before. I bought it uh, earlier this year. Um, it's the replica of uh, Savage Gear Vibration 3D Blade or something it's called. It works really well in Turkey in uh, fresh water and, uh, and salt water. Let's see if this works. I might get a macro. See how we get on with this. Right, several cast after. Time to change. Uh, put a good old extra wedge on. It's about 28 grams. Death of wedge. I'm going to put this do the business. Here we go. <laughs> the seal's still here. That guy caught him again. It'll be interesting if I get it. Catch it. Alright, here we go on the deck of edge. Right, nothing on the lures, uh, guys. So on the back on the back on the good old mackerel feathers. Looks like quite a few mackerels about. So might as well sort the freezer out, fill you up for the upcoming sessions. Right, let's go.
fish on guys, fish on mud pills. See there's that couple on it. And it took a few cast with the feathers. Nice three T Joey, the bottom one's a better size. Good base size though. I might keep a few of these for tog fishing and uh, ray fishing in the Mersey. Size. Right, quick dispatch, all you do is just thumb, mid mouth, right neck, put them out of the misery. Let's get a few more. Oh yeah. Three back to you. for the better size before the seal gets it. Got four on there. No five. Full house. Alright, chuck some of these back anyway. It's too small. Just got to the hot spot here. Well, I'm gonna have a quick couple of casts here with the dark savage to see if I can get hold of a mackerel to see Yep, fish on. Yeah, 
the Macrolon first cast. <coughs> Not bad size. Good bait. I've got a visitor here as well. See you just down below, hiding. There it is. Second class on this spot. It's where the deep mark this is. Where I was before. A lot deeper here. Still there. Go ahead, yep, yeah, push on, yep, yeah, push on. Small, I think. So many small ones about. Oops. Come off. Come here. Straight down. Good sports on the decks there, no point chucking feathers all day, hammering the limit, catching tons of it, like they do on my left, bucket full, no point. Time to pack up. Really enjoyable morning on the feathers and there. Took a couple of lures and sand deals and that, but nothing on them. So I'll so give it a dash of wedge I got and uh, got me a couple of fish. Really hot spots here for mackerel. Mackerel were in about May time on this spot. But uh, might as well give this spot a go. Nice, uh, nice and early get up. Yeah, got about eight, eight macro for the freezer. Uh, good bait for the future uh, sessions. It clearly on the 
on the entrance up there there's a sign saying uh, 20 uh, mackerel per ang angler for people literally taking a piss here Uh, once they can book a full of them. No wonder most of them are like a jovey mackerel. They don't have time to grow up and get bigger. Anyway, that's it for today's episode guys. What a morning it was. Well worth to getting up early. Obviously it was five o'clock in the morning and just got half eight now. Right, I'll see you on the next episode guys, thanks for watching, see you soon.